Well, they've arrested both the suspect and his girlfriend, and after talking to the both of them, they believe that jealousy was the motive. Here at the 7-Eleven, there's a small memorial for Christian Dominguez, and we're now seeing surveillance video of that accident. 18-year-old Christian Dominguez is seen on surveillance video walking across the parking lot of the 7-Eleven. A white pickup truck pulls in and drives out of view. Police say the driver tried to run him over and missed. Another camera angle shows the truck chasing Christian seconds before hitting him and crashing into the building. Nobody ever expects this. To us, we're still waiting for him to walk to the door and tell us that he's home. Jessica Milan, Christian's sister-in-law, says his brother and father are devastated by the jealousy-fueled murder. This is so crazy because he, he never do nothing. Fontana police say John Nieto, the driver of the truck, thought his girlfriend, Elizabeth Mancia, was cheating on him because Mancia would occasionally drive Christian home from work. On Wednesday night, police say Nieto waited and watched his girlfriend drop off Christian, then intentionally ran him over. Nieto ran from the scene and was picked up by his girlfriend. They were later arrested. Enojado al principio porque no sabía Christian's father says at first he was upset because he didn't understand the suspect's motives. But now that they're behind bars, he thinks there will be justice. The family says Christian was always happy and had the ability to win people over. Whether he spoke English or Spanish, he always got him to, to fall in love with him, with his personality and how he really was. Nieto is in jail accused of murder. Meantime, Mancia is in jail accused of being an accessory to murder. Police say that she witnessed the accident. She gave her boyfriend a ride away from the scene and did not call police or try to help Christian Dominguez. Meantime, his family has set up a GoFundMe to help pay for his funeral.